Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe on this video to get notified every time I post a new video. This channel is filled with a whole bunch of random stuff, so make sure you click that notification bell to get notified when a new video comes out, because the next video, honestly, I don't even know. I just be posting a whole bunch of random stuff, so make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on the bell. So, Merry Christmas to everyone. If you're seeing this on December 25th, Merry Christmas. If you're seeing this after New Year's, Happy New Year to everyone. But in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I got for Christmas 2022. So if you guys haven't seen like my previous video, I did like two videos ago where I did Christmas list ideas. I'm gonna basically break it down in categories like how I did that one. So I'm gonna break it down from like clothes to candy that I got to like electronics to like just random other stuff I got. So yeah. So make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe on this video, and let's get to the video. So the first category I have is the clothes category, of course. First thing I gotta show you is the clothes. So the first thing I got is these two beanies, you know, gotta protect my head for the winter, you know, it's, it's getting cold. But I got this from my mom. It comes in, it's like um, grayish black and also a lighter gray on the back. I also did ask for beanies on my Christmas list because I didn't want to get cold. This is the brand Bula. I think that's how you pronounce it. You can't really see it, but yeah, Bula. It says merino wool, thermal protection, and breathable. So that's really a plus for my head because I got short hair right now. I cut all my hair off. So the wind low key be coming like through my hair at all. I had be cold. So the next thing I got is this Stranger Things t-shirt. All black Stranger Things t-shirt. Aim your ass, that's it. Bam! Oh no! Bro, this is so tough. I got this from my brother. Thank you, Ty. If you're watching this video, I appreciate sure you are. He got this from, I believe, PacSun, because it does have a PacSun tag on it. It says Max on the back, and it has her, like, looking. If y'all know me, I'm a huge, like, Stranger Things fan. So this shirt is really tough to me. Like, I really like this shirt. It has, like, little puff print on the front where it says Stranger Things, and then, boom, on the back, Max. Stop playing with your boy. But, yeah, that's hard. Next thing I got is cool little puffer vest. My mom got this for me, putting to be warm. I also be looking hard in the winter. You know, it's December. We still got like January, February. Still got like two months of winter left. But if y'all see me at school, popped out with this. Yeah, just know I got this for Christmas. Stop playing. Next thing I got is some compression pants. Compression pants is always good. Like, especially like me, I'm a track runner. So I can use these for like practice. Or, like I could just even put them under my spandex shorts for like track meets and stuff. And these are also really hard. Um, it says heat retention, soft hand feel, quick dry, comfort stretch, and anti-odor. So all of those five things are really good. Um, I don't know what brand this is. 32 degrees heat, I'm guessing. That's what it says on the back and on the front. But this is a two pack and yeah. Next thing I got is some sweats, you know. The open leg sweats is always the way to go. I got me some gray sweats for the winter. I really need sweats and I really like sweats because I'm I'm tall. So I would wear like a pair of sweats one time and then wash it and then they will shrink. Like, bro, I'm always telling my mom, like, mom, I need a new pair of sweats. And she's always like, bro, like, I just bought you a new pair. But I finally got a new pair of sweats and hopefully these fit me and they don't shrink after one wash. But I got me a pair of sweats from Tech Gear. If you guys can see that. Um, I'm like six foot, so these are a size medium. So if you guys like want to purchase these, you guys know what size they are. But yeah, to also go with these pairs of sweats, I also got a nice gray hoodie, this plain hoodie from the same company, Tech Gear. And this material is really, really good. Like it's thick, it's soft, it's not itchy or whatever. Like it says it's warm, comfortable, and supports more sustainable cotton firming. So um, these are really, really great material hoodies and sweats for the winter or just for like outdoor use if you guys want a pair. The next thing on my list I got is Black YouTuber, you know, yeah, you know, you know, black YouTuber, if I was to record this video right now, I wouldn't be having this hoodie, but this hoodie is so hard, like, I really like this hoodie, I forgot where I got it from, but I could link the description down below if you guys want to also purchase this hoodie, I really do mess with this hoodie, because I like it a lot, it has a lot of vibrant colors, and it also, like, it's, it's telling people that I'm a black YouTuber, so I really think that this is really, like, my type of style, I really, I really like this. Probably like top three favorite things I got on my Christmas list this year. Black YouTuber hoodie is what I got. It's really hard, really tough. And it also, when I seen this on the website, it's also had like a whole bunch of different colorways. So if you guys want a different color, like in white or like blue or anything, then you guys could go and purchase one in a different color. I got one in black because I like black and black goes with everything. 
So, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Next thing I got is, you know, cool little pair of skinny jeans from, I think, Aeropostale. Once again, I am like six feet, six one. So, if you guys want to know what size, that is a 32X34. As you guys can see right there. Um, it's like the stress look. So, it has like some holes in it. They're like a, like a dark grayish kind of, as you guys can see in the light. They're just dark gray. But these are our stacked skinny jeans. As you guys can see, let me show y'all the tab. It says stacked skinny jeans right there. Next thing I got also, once again, is another pair of sweats. This time these are black and they're also open leg. And it's from the same company, Tech Gear, size medium. To also go with those sweats, of course, had to get the all black hoodie too from the same brand, Tech Gear. And this is also a size medium. So I'll be wearing this a lot. I like solid colored clothes because they just go with everything. So if you're wearing like some khaki pants or like some cargos, you could just throw on this black hoodie. It's nice and warm, comfortable, you know? And yeah. And for the last two things I have for the clothing category is a sl all white slim fit t-shirt from H&M. My brother got me these. Shout out to Ty, he got me right with these slim fit t-shirts. These are a size small from H&M. So if you guys want to go to H&M, get y'all some slim fit t-shirts, go ahead. Or you guys could order them online, I'm pretty sure. These are really good for like the summer. Or if you guys just like going out somewhere because they're slim fit, they really like show your body definition. So that's why I really like these t-shirts. My brother hooked me up with two of them. So yeah. So that's it for the clothing category. The next category I have, I'm, I'm going to go with shoes because clothing, shoes, you know, it matches. All right. So the first thing... First shoes I have are the golf slides. Come on now, golf slides, they're like the new trending slides and I got them, I've been wearing them for like the past like hour, like literally right since I opened the gift, I put them on and they're really, really comfortable. These ones also have the little spaces in them too, so you can add the gibbets in it. But I think these are like a cream type of color. I know that these come in multiple colorways, like green and black and purple and stuff. I got the cream colorway because why not get the cream color? Shout out to Ty, because he also got me these two. Got me right. These were also my Christmas list. So, golf slides. Yeah. So, the next pair of shoes I have is my very first pair of Doc Martens. I wanted a pair of Doc Martens because it's like, they're just like a nice pair of boots. And they're like a nice dress shoe. And I literally don't have any shoes like that I can just put on casually and go out to a nice event in. The ones I got, I just got the plain simple original all black ones the all black boots with the gum bottom i heard that you have to break these in first to for like for them to actually get comfortable so we gonna see but shout out to my mom she got these from um journeys i just got the plain original ones and we gonna see I, this is like my first pair of boots so i know that i could probably style these with like some jeans or something i really wanted me a pair of dots either these or the low top ones I got these, so. So, as y'all probably know, I run track. So, I got me a new pair of spikes. These spikes are so hard, they're like highlighter light spikes, as you guys can see. It says multi, and they have blue on the bottom, which I really like, like, this blue is super hard, and then you guys can see the Nike logo. These are called um, Nike Zoom Rival Multi. I really mess with these. Um, they came with the spike key and then the black spikes in them. And also, these came with a white bag. I know my track runners, y'all probably know, like usually the spikes come in a lime green bag, but these ones, I guess the newer version of spikes come in a white bag. I definitely needed some more spikes because my other ones was starting to get worn out and they started to get too small for me. So this was the perfect time. I got me a brand new pair of spikes. So that wraps it up for the shoes category. I got me three pairs of shoes, the golf slides, the Doc Martens, and the pair of spikes. So the next category I'm gonna get into is the like electronic slash like room type of category. First thing I got is this. Y'all probably asking like, what is that? Let me show y'all, hold on. So this is what it is. It says open late, it's like a neon sign. Shout out to my sister, she got these. I put like white and black posters to put in my room cause I needed some more. I'm gonna I'm probably find a place to put it somewhere. I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet. I don't know if I wanna put it on that wall or like somewhere else, but that's my sister for getting me this. Y'all probably saying like, what's in the bag is nothing. It's just like white cardboard box. But this is an actual poster. So shout out to her for getting me this. The next thing I got is electronic. I got some noise canceling Sony headphones. Y'all know me, 
I love noise canceling headphones and like good quality sound. My AirPods that I have now, they are not noise canceling. Like I will put them in full blast and I can still hear. Like why can I still hear? But I got these and now these are noise canceling. I don't think they're made for Apple, but I'm pretty sure if you just get like a, um, a little dongle extender jack and you plug that into your iPhone, then it will work. Like it works for certain iPhones, but for my iPhone, I have a 13. Obviously there's no headphone jack, but if I get like a connector, then I'm pretty sure they will work. So the next thing I got is this. This is a sneaker candle, specifically Air Force Ones, as you guys can see. I put this on my Christmas list, not really expecting anyone to get it for me, but my sister, shout out to you, Deja, she got this candle for me, and I'm gonna probably put it like somewhere on here, but this is like a really hard, unique thing that I wanted for my room, and I ended up getting this. All right, so the last and final thing, you guys are probably asking like, I know, I know, I got me a little briefcase, but, 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 hold on. This is not no type of ordinary briefcase. Hold on, open it up, open it up, open it up. Yeah, yeah. Record player, vintage record player briefcase, bro. This is so hard, like I wanted this so bad. This actually plays like real record vinyls and I think it's also Bluetooth. So you could connect it to your phone or play a real record vinyl on it. So I know that Walmart sell these and it's like a different brand, but this one is so hard. Like you could literally open and close it and like no one would know that it says whole record player in it. So I'm gonna definitely keep this open. I'm gonna definitely buy some records to play and to put on there. And I'm gonna try to like figure this out and try to work it out and see that if it is Bluetooth, I'm pretty sure it is. I'm not sure though. So I'm gonna have to definitely play around with this and see what it's all about. So yeah. So next thing I got is this sensory toy fidget box. So my mom got me this for Christmas and it literally comes with like a whole bunch of little toys. So like this, it came with a ball, I already solved it, but they all came scrambled up. So like this green right here would be like over here at this pink and you have to try to get it to the proper color. It has an open space so you can like rearrange all the other stuff and like get it to the proper color. But yeah, I already solved it because I was bored. So it also comes with like this. I don't really know what that, I think it's like a little fidget spinner. It's like a thing where you can mold the shapes and stuff. You take it and then you could spin it and stuff. Next thing in the box is this like multi thing. So these, I don't, I honestly don't know what these are. This, I think you just like, it's just for the filling. This part also, you just like twist it. This is like a little joystick thing. You can play around with it. It's, um, some little ASMR, but it's like a little clicker. This are also some buttons that you can press. And these are like some little sliders. And then here, of course, classic switch. And then over here is also another button. And then there's also this one. I don't really, I, I never really got the point. Like what, like, what does this do? Like. You just put your finger there. And also this too, I also really don't know what this is for. Like, do we twist it, like pull it up? Like, I don't, I don't know. And this, I think if you wanna like strap it onto something like your backpack, it also has a hook, so you could do that. But yeah, this is probably one of my favorite ones cause it has like the clicky ones. So I really like that. Well, next up are these little two keychain things. I think you just like twist them in and out and it's just like a little fun thing, but you just keep twisting it, keep twisting it, keep twisting it. And then you can also play with these little metal things. So yeah. I also got this folding thing. I think you keep folding it like in and out and then it just keeps folding back and forth. Like you keep folding it over each other. But these little folding cubes. I also got this thing. It's like a little marble inside this little mesh thingy. And you just push the marble back and forth. I guess it's fun. So yeah. This is also like a little controller. These buttons click. And then this, of course, is a casual joystick. This part on the top, I don't really know what this is. Like, I guess you just twist it. And then there's also this thing on the side where it's like, you can retract it back. And then on the back, there is a little switch clicker. And then there's also this thing that you can rotate. And also on the bottom, there's a roller. And then there's also like this little textured part on the controller that you can use. So there's like five different fidgets in this one controller. So that, that's pretty cool. 
Also another little marble mesh thingy, but just in a different pink color. And then the last thing is like this, li I don't really know how to describe this, but it's like magnets that you can stick together and then you can also like spin it around. Like they're, you can spin it around and you can also stick marbles together. I thought it was like a little fidget spinner at first, but it's, it's not. So I don't really know how you would describe this, but I guess it's just like, a fidget thing, I guess. That was everything in this little fidget box. They're like little fun fidget toys. So yeah. So on to the next category. I don't really know what this category is. I guess this could be the last category. There's a whole bunch of extra stuff like stocking stuffers and a whole bunch of other stuff that didn't really fit into the other categories. So the first thing I had is this Bath and Body Works um, like set. This has a three in one hair, face and body wash. This has a body spray in it, and then this also has lotion. The scent is black tie. I have not smelled it yet. As y'all can see, like, it's still tied up. But yeah, I got a three-in-one kit with spray, body wash, and lotion. So, men's essentials, of course, gotta have it. Next thing I have is, is this Nautica Blue. I got some cologne, and then this, I don't really know what this is. Deodorizing body spray. So, I think it's, I think it's, do you order it, but you spray it instead of like the actual stick that you put under. I haven't smelled this either, so I don't even know what this smells like. But Nautica Blue, of course, once again, many essentials, cologne, some nice fresh cologne. So we're gonna test it out, see how it smells, see how it's gonna fit, and yeah. Next thing I got is this $20 Wendy's gift card. Shout out to my brother's girlfriend, Mia, if you're watching this. Appreciate you for this Wendy's gift card. Yeah, Wendy's, if y'all don't know, Wendy's is probably like my favorite fast food place because Wendy's just looks like so good. Like, get you a fofo -fo -fo. Like, come on now. So, $20 gift card. Mia, shout out to you. Appreciate you for this gift card. And yeah. So another thing that I got is this Sour Patch Kids AirPod case. I got a new AirPod case finally because uh, if you guys know, I had a Twizzlers AirPod case and I had that AirPod case for like since last year since last christmas i'm pretty sure so shout out to my sister because she also got me this so i will be changing that out it's like a new year ritual thing like every single year i get a new air case for christmas but david shout out to you appreciate you for this air case so the next thing i got is i i i got some books so the first book i got is the boy in the black suit i don't know what this book is about but pretty sure if y'all pause to read that Y'all could probably know what it's about. This book, definitely gonna read. And then also, next book I got is Rich Dad Poor Dad. I wanted this book so bad to like see what it's about and like actually read it and just like understand uh, like a whole bunch of stuff. So I also got this. And then the last book I got is this book it says Mental Toughness for Young Athletes. So if you guys read the back, you guys could also know what it's about. It says eight proven, eight proven five minute mindset exercise for key, for kids and teens who play competitive sports. So, yeah. So the last and final things I have is like my little stocking stuffer slash like candies that I got. So first thing I got was a really long Rice Krispie Treat bar. It's just like a normal flavor Rice Krispie Treat, of course. Next thing I got is this Blue Raspberry Sour Warheads Pop Rocks. That's what it's called, Pop Rocks. So these Blue Raspberry Warheads Pop Rocks, so that's what I got. Twizzlers, as you guys know, I love Twizzlers. Like, y'all hate on Twizzlers so much, and y'all be trying to debate me, talking about some. Red Lines is better. Twizzlers is always the way to go, man. Like, come on, I'm about to, after this video, I'm about to tear these open, and <laughs> next thing I got is Watermelon Sour Patch Kids. These are top three best candies. Don't at me on that. Watermelon Sour Patch Kids is the way to go. Speaking of Sour Patch Kids, you got the normal Sour Patch Kids, of course, Stranger Things. It's gonna do it for me every single time. Like, you already know, Stranger Things is my show. Like, it's gonna do it for me every single time. Shout out to my mom, because I ain't never seen these, and she got this for me. I think it's a normal Sour Patch Kids, as you guys can see in the back, but the packaging is cool, so that's also a plus. And the last thing I got is these Rips Candy. I think it's just watermelon flavored, but I think it's just the green ones. Rips are so smack. Go to our nearest gas station and get you a bag of Rips, bro. I'm, I'm putting y'all on to one of the best candies out there that a lot of y'all don't really know about. So Rips, go ahead, 
Go to the gas station, go to the 996 store, go to your local convenience store, wherever, and get y'all a bag of these. I'm telling y'all. It comes with like all red or all green or like a mix of both. So red and green. The green ones to me are the best ones. Come on now. Common sense. Green is the best one. But that is everything I got for Christmas 2022. If you guys are interested in anything I got in this video, comment down below and I'll most likely probably link it to the description. So just let me know if you guys want to know anything where I got from this video and make sure y'all like, comment and subscribe. Thank y'all for like 1.8K subscribers. Like that Christmas list idea video like blew up, bro. It got like 90K views and I got like almost 2,000 subscribers. So thank y'all very much for all the support and all the love that y'all showed on that video. And until next time, peace. Nah, I don't like that. I don't like that. What should I do? Like, should I dap y'all up? Or like, I don't know. Like, go ahead, dap me up. Yeah, I'll probably, I'll, I'll probably do that for my outro because I don't like saying peace. Like, peace is so like 2013. We about to be in the year 2023. Like, I gotta, I gotta get a new intro and get a new outro. Like, I gotta get an intro telling y'all what my channel is filled with and like an outro, like our own little unique special outro. So like, I don't know, that like, dap me up. Come on now, like the daily dap up. Every time y'all see my video, dap me up. So that's what I'm gonna probably do. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure y'all like, come subscribe, come on, dap me up. And until next time.